Okay, team. Here's what's been happening on Ghost Rider. The facts. First, Alex is running for school president, but somebody is out to ruin his campaign with dirty smear flyers that say Alex sleeps with a Mickey Mouse nightlight and cries at the sight of fried chicken. So, Alex is really embarrassed, but he doesn't give up. The election is only one week away, and the team is on the case. Now, here are some new facts from the last show. First, the smear flyers are really hurting Alex's campaign. Those things really stick in people's minds. We need to stick other pictures in their minds. So Alex and his friends decide to make a video to prove Alex isn't a wimp. Then, Ghost Rider sends Alex and Gabby a message about Nitu, one of the suspects. Alex, you are a nice guy. She likes you, Alex. And if she likes you, then she's not a suspect. Next, another smear flyer showed up at school. Alex Fernandez was secret love post to a science teacher? And Alex discovers another suspect. I never told you about running love poems to my science teacher, but I know who I did tell. One of my pen pals. Then something really weird happened. Goodbye, Jamal. You can see that? What's the word on the new kid? And how is Alex's campaign cleaning up? OK, Ghost Rider, here's the score. Janet has a secret plan to win the election. Jeffrey and his campaign manager, Calvin, are breaking some school rule. Nitu didn't do it because she likes Alex. One of Alex's pen pals may be guilty because Alex wrote letters about his secrets. And what about the new kid, Rob? He dropped a note that sounded like he had something to hide. Get a pencil in your casebook out and keep track of the clues, because the Ghostwriter team is on the case. It wasn't my fault, you guys. I didn't do anything. Huh? What was it your fault? I was just minding my own business. What are you talking about? You remember that new kid from the computer room? The one who was writing that thing about feeling guilty? Gabby told me about him. Well, his name is Rob. Yeah, so? And he can see Ghost Rider's words. What? You sure? Wow. Does this is mean he doing this? Well, listen up, listen up. It was like he was frozen. You can tell it's his first time. We all know how that feels. So it's not like Ghost Rider has been talking to him all along. Right, but it wasn't a mistake either. Ghost Rider wrote, Hello, Rob. That's how I know his name. But Rob's a suspect. He's our enemy. Does that mean Ghost Rider's our enemy too? No way. Just because Ghost Rider messed up doesn't mean he's our enemy. Ghosts can make mistakes too. So you shouldn't go around blaming people because I don't not... care what that kid saw. Ghost Rider's our friend. And he's the one that helped us see that smear before it came up. And don't forget, he's the one that helped us prove that Nitu was innocent. That's right. So maybe this guy Rob is okay. Hey, Ghost Rider would not have talked to him if he was trying to hurt Alex. But Ghost Rider doesn't let just anybody see him. Why Rob? Let's ask him. Oh, man. 
Guess we'll have to catch up with Rob in school on Monday. I can't wait till Monday. You have to. We have a video to shoot this weekend. Oh, that's right, the video. Let's start at 5 a.m. like they do in Hollywood. 5 a.m.? Oh. I think we should wait until the sun comes up. I'll see you in the park around 9. Bye. See ya. Bye. Oh, I can't make it. I'm starting karate on Saturday. Karate? Where? Youth Center. I hear the instructors are third-degree black belts. Whoa. But, uh, I can show them a thing or two. I got a couple of moves. <laughs> yeah, like turn around and run away. <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing here? Just couldn't resist. But I don't know. Nah, don't worry. You're going to do just fine. As long as you don't break any bones. <laughs> Thanks. You're a big help. Karate begins and ends with courtesy. Hmm? When an instructor enters the room, you bow to show your respect. <laughs> now, before you learn to block and punch, you must learn the most important karate lesson. Karate is used for defense only, not for uh, picking fights. Huh? We'll have no ninjas here. Okay. <laughs> I am Sensei Kabata. Sensei means teacher. Right. Let's get started. if I never ate chicken again. <laughs> Guild scope. Now, we are going to practice punching and blocking. One person punches to the chest, huh? Show! While the other blocks. Show! Wait. Right. Oh. <laughs> Let's start with the mirror first. Hmm? Okay. With the punch to the chest. Now we block. Wait. Now. now let's start with a partner facing each other. Ah, stop! You didn't wait for the command, huh? Before we start with the partner, we have to show respect. Okay. okay. Now, my side. Attacks. Huh? The other side. Defense. Slow speed. Okay. 
Begin. Other way. Again. Jamal, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean it, Jamal. Are you okay? Relax and breathe. You just got the wind knocked out of you. You'll be all right. How's karate? All right. I guess I'll go back on Monday. How'd the video go? Great. We finished it. What are you doing? Trying to figure out which pen pal I told all my secrets to. How? By reading their letters. Sometimes they write things to me about what I wrote to them. So I'm going to see if any of them wrote anything about the nightlight, chicken, or love letter. Good idea. I'm trying to help. At that rate you're going, you'll never get through all these before the election. Will, too. And my pen pals wouldn't want anyone snooping. You could save time if you don't read every word. If I don't read every word, how am I going to know what I'm reading? I mean, skim the letters. Just look for important words. Oh, I get it. Like nightlight. Right. Or science teacher. Chicken. Love poems. Shut up. There. I know. Now what are you gonna do? I know how to make this go even faster. I'm gonna write down the important words so Ghost Rider can help me. Yeah. Nightlight. Love poems. Science teacher. Chicken. <laughs> Crying. Thanks. Just trying to help. from Sarah. She's from London. And she has this really fat cat. Skim. Hey, science teacher. I found one. If I was a science teacher, I would set all the frogs free. Oh, this is about her science class. Bell in New Orleans. So what's she crying about? Oh, her brother stepped on her worm farm. <laughs> Cattle farm in Rock Museum. Love poems, Gabby. Listen to this. Don't be embarrassed about the love poems you wrote to your science teacher. I think it's romantic. Let me see. No, but I found it. You know who you told? Yep, Catherine Brody from Texas. Let's see what else I told her. Chicken, here it is. I told Catherine about the fried chicken too. And here's stuff about the nightlight. She's definitely the one behind these smears. Just because she knows doesn't mean she told. You shouldn't go around blaming people. I'm not blaming Gabby. I have proof. Catherine Brody's the one. Words that fly. Magic words. No.
words that fly hanging in air. Friend, nothing. I don't even know if I saw it or not. What's going on here? Pen pals are so great. It's like having friends all over the world. And you get mail all the time. I thought Catherine was like the rest. She showed you, man. Yeah. I feel like such a sucker. She seems so nice. That's why it was easy to tell her things I could never tell anybody else. Maybe it wasn't her. She's the only one I told all three secrets to. Ghostwriter helped me check every single letter. And I double-checked all the others. Too bad, too. I really liked hearing about her dad's cattle ranch in Texas. Texas? Yeah. She even gets to help her dad brand cattle. Can you imagine? Sss, circle B. That's their symbol. I hate to bust your bubble, but Texas is thousands of miles away. Why would a girl in Texas care about a school election here? Besides, how could she post flyers at Hurston? Yeah, that's what I can't figure out. Jamal, right? Uh-huh. Can I talk to you? What? Alone. Look, Ghost Rider told me to speak with you. Ghost Rider? You better sit down. So, how'd you find out? I was working on the computer, and all of a sudden these letters. And I asked some questions, and he said he wants to be my friend. What about... Hey, I knew Ghost Rider a long time before you did. Well, who else knows? Don't answer. He's still a suspect. Oh, come off you. Yeah. Remember the confession we read? I'm not guilty of anything. Prove it. I don't have to prove anything to you. Hold this. Nobody's accusing anybody of anything, OK? We're just trying to figure things out. OK. He felt choked with guilt. He wanted to come clean but he was afraid to speak. If he did, he'd be in trouble. Big trouble. Sure sounds like a confession to me. Look what came before it. Go ahead. Josh watched in horror as the magic cup slipped out of his hands, breaking to a million pieces. He had killed the magic. The wizard was gonna be furious. He felt choked with guilt. He wanted to come clean. Oh, now I get it. This isn't a confession. This is part of a story you were writing. I thought this meant you were guilty. Oh, man. No big deal. I'm sorry I got up in your face like that. I've just been so crazy to find out who's behind these smears. It's OK. Hey, hold up. W what does the wizard do? Where's the rest? The story's not finished yet. I'm Alex. Jamal Jenkins. Rob Baker. Ghost Rider. Oh, no, not another one. He must be reading the next mirror. 
But where's it coming from? Hey, where are you going? Creep hunting. And remember, your meeting is top secret, so don't tell. I'll show you know who how bad I want to win. have camp and headquarters on school property. That's against the rules. That's just a dumb little rule. You know, you don't look too good. Those smear flies must have been getting you down. I meant to tell you how sorry I was about that. You don't sound too sorry. Hey, if there's anything we can do to help, just let me know. Bye. Are you here for class, Jamal? Well, I don't know. It's like, I want to, but... Well, I've been thinking. Yes? I'm not sure karate's my thing. I mean, it looks cool and all, but I'm not sure it's for me. My leg? I was just... And you're just in time for a talk. The ego's a funny thing. Do you know what the ego is? <laughs> it's pride. It's a feeling that we're better than other people. When the ego gets hurt, it hurts a lot more than getting punched right here. You're talking about me, right? Am I? Look, I know what you're trying to say, but I got beaten by a little kid. Don't call me a little kid. There wasn't a fight, and Gabby didn't beat you, so there's no reason to be embarrassed. What? It was just an exercise. What happened was that Gabby lost control. Hmm? Control and discipline are the most important lessons you can learn in karate. You haven't learned that yet. I didn't mean to lose control. <laughs> I know you didn't. That is to be expected because you are a beginner. So is Gabby's fault? No. What I'm saying is you both have lessons to learn. Yours is leave your ego at the door. Hmm? Okay. This is a class, not a competition. If you want to study karate, you can't worry about what other people think of you. Hmm? Line up. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. 